Hi, I'm Jim Shipstead, one of the pastors here at the First Congregational Church of Anaheim. And I'm just so happy that we have uh, Bishop Taisi Amoa here, uh, who's been at our church here for the last over 15 years. Mm -hmm. And they have a wonderful ministry here. And, and I'm so grateful for him. And it's been good to get to know him over the years. We're planning to go to Fiji together on a mission. And uh, yes. just a lot of good things have been happening. <laughs> He's originally from Samoa. Uh, he had gone to, uh, in the Midwest, he had a football scholarship. As you can tell, he's a pretty big guy. <laughs> and, uh, and anyway, so we thought we'd just kind of do a, a encouragement together for today. Yeah. So, uh, together. So, anyway, what, well, what's on your mind? <laughs> well, thank you, Pastor Jim. It's a, it's a great moment, a time to share. You know, when we think about this time we're in, we'll, we'll look at the tree right here with all different colors. And uh, we think about the spirit, the acting spirit of Christmas, the uh, spirit of our Lord, and celebrating the birth of our Savior. Yeah. It's, it's one of the greatest uh, feeling for us to have in this moment in times of our lives. But we thank you for a, a nice and beautiful introduction. But, uh, you know, if we can look at the verse we think about the today, uh, found in Ephesians chapter 2, verse 10. It says, For we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus, unto good works, which good had before ordained, that we should walk in them. Mm -hmm. So when we think about this very Christmas and the birth of our Lord, we think about giving God a thanksgiving, the opportunity that we have to be alive and have a new life in Christ, mm -hmm. and uh, looking at to be more positive in the work that God has given to us. So I believe the Christmas this year will be a very blessed one, and it's gonna not only uh, Reminding us that Jesus is not die again and birth again, but reminding us it's a continuation relationship and knowing that our prayer for those who are in, in this time of the season is really, really needed. And we know it's a season of gifts and yeah. we believe that uh, if this is what the Lord wants us to do, He says He created us into a new creation. That means uh, He prepared us for the good works. And those good works is to help others, yeah. pray for others. Uh, presenting gifts to our children. I think there's a lot of good deeds oh, yeah. we have to a lot of good things uh, perform and ministering in the in the body of Christ. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, I was just so thankful. I want to thank many of you who have been given to the Pan American Institute. Uh, mm -hmm. Pastor Emily went down to Tijuana uh, this past Monday and was able to uh, send some funds over there and uh, to be able, be able to help those people in need. And then many of you have been bringing all kinds of clothes and everything that'll be yes. going to Grandma's House of Hope. That's wonderful. That's uh, a wonderful mm -hmm. ministry here, and it helps so many people. I know you guys have been doing a lot of things as well, but the toys that are going to be given out. Well, actually, tonight we are giving the toys to the community and also toys to the children of the ministry, and we call whoever's in this area of mm -hmm. Anaheim that they need the gifts for their gifts, their gifts, but also not affordable, not afford to yeah. have gifts. We, you know, we have the opportunity for them to come and present the gifts, whatever gifts we have. Thank God for those who are giver. Yeah. You know, from business, uh, business people, and the people who really have a guidance uh, for the children this year. So we're able to have 250 uh, toys oh, tonight That'll to give great. out. So that's what we're going to set up a little yeah, bit yeah. just to celebrate, yeah, yeah. you know, the Christmas and the spirit of our spirit. Lord. Yeah, that's wonderful. Amen. And what time is your service on Sunday morning if people want to come? Our service on Sunday is at, at 8.30 a.m. Okay. Yeah, and on Wednesday is, is 7 o'clock. It's just the Bible study and cell groups. Yeah. So that's our schedule. Probably the same schedule next year again. Yeah. yeah. And we'll be having a Christmas Eve candlelight service at 7.30, and Rafia will be uh, singing. And then on Christmas Day, we're ha excited to have Izzy. I believe is a, oh, Beautiful. Izzy's not. <laughs> anyway, we will have some good singers. <laughs> Who's singing, Izzy? I mean, Emily. It's going to be a great time, right? Yeah. It's going to be gonna a be great good. time. Mus and music. And, 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 and Emily's going to play violin on Christmas Eve, too. So uh, it'll be a wonderful time. We always uh, pass the candles around. <laughs> we always pray we don't burn the church down because we uh, close, turn the lights off and then light the candles. But it'll be a time of celebration yeah. on Christmas Day also at... Uh, at our normal time at 10.45. But we just want to wish you guys all a Merry Christmas and, and God bless you and thank you for tuning in. Amen.